Hi, I'm Super Dragon, and we're gonna look at some content on Totally Studios today. Um, we're just gonna watch. Cassandra, I need those hair gel production reports. I have a sales meeting tomorrow with Big Mart. Right away, Mr. Becker. Oh, it's one of those Darman actors. Sleeping with oh, a guy without no. using a it's just that condom. Works for a men's hair care company, not a daycare center. No matter what the job, people get pregnant. That's how the world works. Okay, well, I'm the general manager around here. I am responsible for profits, not children. Well, my kids are at home, and when I'm here, I'm working. Yeah, Holy okay. shit. Well, let's keep it that way, yeah? Okay. What the fuck is wrong with this dude? Hasn't he learned? We believe the large mustache is coming back into style for summer, so we are rebranding our entire campaign around that. Have we developed a pomade product? We're repackaging Formula 83. Well, we're going to need a new campaign for that then, huh? We are focusing on social media. Ooh, yeah. She kicked. <laughs> she kicked. How exciting. Do you have a name yet? No, we haven't even thought about it. I've been too busy preparing for maternity leave. I'm surprised the old man Becker is letting you take maternity leave. I don't think he has much choice. The board requires it. This is exactly why I'm never getting <laughs> married. This is the color that the focus group chose for the super mega whole gel formula. Got it. <sighs> Excuse me, Mr. Becker. Do you have a minute? Yes, Cassandra. What is it? I want you to know I'm ready to leave for maternity. Oh, okay, great. You're quitting. I'm not quitting. I'm ready to go on my paid maternity leave. I've been working here for almost 10 years. Working from here? I think last year you were working from home. Well, yeah. So was almost everyone else. When but COVID hit. Everyone else has screaming Dumb kids to asshole. Take care of. Well, the company handbook says I get maternity leave. That's one of the benefits of working here. But with no pay. No pay? The benefits package clearly states we get maternity pay. Because of that technicality, I will let you have your pay. <laughs> That's what you said the other two times! Because With he's a protein, asshole. The longer the hair, the stronger the bond. Oh, that should be a real winner. <laughs> <laughs> hey guys, sorry I'm late. Oh, Cassandra, you gotta see this. <laughs> Is that the new gel product we're introducing in the spring? Yeah! But won't you be out on leave by then? Well, it's funny you should mention that, because I'll be back in the spring. Oh, are you ready to take maternity? Well, yes. Actually, I'm starting today. Oh, you will be missed. I'm surprised you got it approved by old man family record. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he acts like we don't have a family leave policy at all. <laughs> That's because he's a piece of shit. Ethan is getting ready to welcome a baby, but Mr. Becker doesn't like to give out family leave. I wonder if he'll have trouble getting time off. The dude is a shithead. Hey, Mr. Becker. What is it, Ethan? This better be about the new winter sports campaign. Well, actually, this is personal. I don't want to hear about your personal problems, okay? We have a business to run here. Actually, it's not a problem. It's something rather exciting that I want to talk to you about. Oh, what? Something exciting. Well, since I'm so good natured, why don't you tell yeah, me what it right. is? Well, I haven't really shared this with you yet, but we're planning on having a baby. At least I don't have to give you time off like I did with Cassandra. That's just the thing. I came here to prepare you that soon I'll be out on paternity leave. Paternity what leave? What the hell? What is paternity leave? I've never heard of paternity leave. That's when daddy takes time off to take care of the new baby. Well, apparently you flunked biology in high school, wherever you went, because it is women who have the babies and take care of the babies. Well, he's got a in point. In this day and age, men and women are considered equal. Those kind of roles don't exist Not. anymore. Don't get technical with me, okay? Read the handbook like I 
just had to do, and it says that only pregnant staff get leave. And I was good enough to give that leave to Cassandra. The handbook should be changed. You're not good. That's period. Not me, I tell you what. All you, you are is just a. See me when there's a baby in there. Tick. Okay. Yes, Mr. Becker. Mr. Becker. More like Mr. Dickhead. So he tells me to come back when I'm pregnant. Does he not know what century we're in? It's so ironic because the men who buy our products are so enlightened. Since when does the they they guy this? get pregnant? Oh, well, maybe someone should tell him. You know what? That won't be necessary. I have a better idea. Oh, shit. So okay, you. This, this is what I'm talking about right here. Excuse me, Mr. Becker, do you have a minute? Do I look like I have a minute? What is it? I need to talk to you about that maternity leave. Don't you mean paternity leave? Maternity. But I'm going to need to take that time off we were talking about. Why are you wasting my time? I told you you cannot get time off unless you are pregnant. You're well, wasting your own thing. time. Jesus Christ. Some kind of fool. Men cannot get pregnant. The handbook doesn't say I think I'm going to be sick. What the f It just says you get time off if you're pregnant. I don't care if you're a man or a woman or a space alien. You're not getting any time off. Well, you're right about one thing. It doesn't matter if you're a man or a woman. Cassandra got paid time off, and I should too. There is one important difference, however. Cassandra was not faking. I don't think. And you are. If Cassandra you don't know to that? prove it, then I shouldn't either. So am I getting that time off or what? You know what? Oh, shit. I've had a change of heart. I am going to give you that time off. In fact, I'm going to give you unlimited time off. Unlimited? What does that mean? Unlimited, as in, you're fired. What? You're firing me because I'm pregnant? This tan no, dude firing you because keeps you making dick mood I cannot have somebody after dick at move style. after dick really? move. Yeah, really. Now get out of my office. Get out of my building. Ethan's plan to get family leave got him fired. Is there anything he can do about it? So instead of giving him time off, old man Becker fired him. He can't do that. I thought company policy allows family leave. Well, in his mind, it doesn't apply to men. I thought that... Is he forgetting where I think that Mr. Company? Becker dude will have yeah, one last kind of ironic, fuck you up his sleeve. Hmm, maybe he doesn't care because they don't know. He doesn't hmm. care what men think. He Are is a man. What I'm thinking? Or a bitch. You know what? I've said too much. I gotta go. I have a bun in the oven. Bun in the oven? What the hell? I can tell there's gonna be drama. Leading men's hair care company Manstyle has been embroiled in controversy. Industry reports are stating that they actually discriminate against men. As a result, many beauty retailers are reported to be taking their products off the shelves. They're What is this? I gotta tell Mr. Becker. Zach, what is happening? Sales have been falling. That's why I called. I've been watching it. They've been falling because uh, of your know that, okay? actions. That's why I hire you to tell me why Stupid piece sales of are falling. Shit. Turns out, people have been boycotting the brand. I, I don't understand. Why would people be boycotting the brand? They're saying here that man style discriminates against men. Uh, how can what we the hell does that even mean? Men? We don't sell women's hair products. It says here that the company doesn't support paternal rights. I guess it's no secret anymore. Now what am I going to tell the board? That you, you suck ass. That is a terrible idea. Mr. Becker has a meeting with the board. How is he going to explain this? <laughs> In a bad Mr. way. Uh, it's not often that we have the CEO here. I mean, uh... 
To what do I owe this great honor? Uh, we have a problem. Oh my god, this fucking commercial. Sorry about that. I know that sales are down, but it is strictly seasonal. I promise. Yes, I know sales are off, and it's not seasonal, but that's not why I'm here. I'm here because of this employee handbook. Yes, I, I, I know what you are talking about. I have heard all of the banter, and let me assure you that Becker, I have been very strict with your ass is Here, man, busted. Now, put employees first. This handbook was written decades ago. It's up to you to make sure it's current with the times. But what am I supposed to do if that's what the book says? Stop. The book doesn't write itself. Oh. What am I supposed to do? Come running to you every time business standards change? I am the general manager, okay? That is not my job. You know what? You're right. That's the job of the company president. But we don't have one of those. Unless you want to make me company president. You? Actually, we do now. <laughs> and I'd like you to meet him. Unbelievable. My name's Ethan, but you can call me Mr. Adams. Wait, what? Th this, guy, this guy is my boss now? Yep. That's right. And he calls Beat his ass. Now. I plan to address company policies. But first, I've made a staffing decision. Staffing decision? Don't you think that I should be consulted? I'm consulting with you right now. You're fired. Wait. <laughs> what? No. You cannot fire me. He just oh, did. Because and you're I such a stuck-up mother... get out of my office. And get out of my building. Yeah, mother... <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Becker refused to accept that times change. Remember, just because something was done a certain way in the past doesn't mean it's right for today. Duh. You know, this Totally Studio stuff is really good. I would highly recommend y'all watch it. I mean, they're not telling stories. They're also changing lives. <laughs> if only they could change my life. Uh, that's all for tonight. Happy New Year. Good night.